Yo, yo, what it do, what it do, it's your boy Mo Hustle, and we are now live on the hot seat. Y'all know what it is. Introduce yourself one time, Stiletto. Stiletto from the ghetto, huh. HTX Records, producer, <laughs> artist. The man, the myth, the legend, the Hustle Town legend. Hustle Town. H-Town legend, veterano, mm -hmm. what else you want to call it, all kinds of shit. You know what I'm saying? And over here, yes, on, sir. on my left, go ahead and introduce yourself, man. Swiss Papa, man, from all the way from Denver. It's Young Dom, man, the yeah. youngest son. You know what I mean? Young Dom. Young Dom. Young Dom, Dom the man. Youngest son. The boy dominating the game, man, real Facts. quick. The youngest son. What do you mean, the youngest son? It's the youngest son from the one, man. Son from the one. one. That's yeah. good. I like that, right. man. Hold on, man. You know what my dad was right. trying to say my rap name was? Yeah. He's like, you know what I really like? Dom the Don. Okay. And I was like, what would you mean, man? Just right uh, now, like not too uh, long ago, before I put up over here. No shit. He's be he be trying to find me rapper names and shit, but I'm like, shit, it's RBI Young Dom, man. Yeah, he's he's good at that. He's he good. Put up from Denver when? Huh? Denver? Yeah, when Denver, you, Colorado, man. On Friday, bro. I booked a flight on Friday. Oh. While I was at work, got off of work, went straight to the airport, came over here like some movie type shit, man. Oh, Finally yeah. landed over here. You Is feel it me? your first time in H Town? Nah, it's my second time, second bro. Time. Dope. Second When's time. the last time you was in H? It's about two years ago. Two years already. Uh, yeah. oh, no, no, no. I'm tripping. I think one year ago, bro. All right. How, how you yeah, liking H Town so far? Shit, man, I love this shit, man. <laughs> it's cool. But it's like different from Denver, bro. Huh. You know what I mean? I'm a real Denver, born and raised native. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like I Denver fuck with Denver, man. Roots. Denver, man. I got love for Denver, man. For real. Yeah, yeah for we, we got a lot of we got a, yeah we got a lot of history in Denver. It's my second home, Colorado, man. Mm -hmm. yeah, man, we fuck with that Chubbies and that home, motherfucking uh. You know about that Chubby. All of that good shit, you know the motherfucking more side shit. Yeah. The, uh, the other shit though, the uh. uh where they get the steaks on federal. What is that one right there? The Columbine, Columbine Steakhouse. Steakhouse. Yeah. Ah, you know what I mean? There you that's go. That's some South Fed stuff. Fucking man. hell, yeah. Right on that's federal. That's like first, second, and feds, man. You yeah. know what I mean? Nah, yeah. I fuck with that Chinese spot next to there, bro. You yeah. ever had that new Chinese spot? Oh, I have. I have had, had the Asian Fire, bro. Store, yeah. Grew it's up crazy, on that man. shit, man. But I grew up over there by. Houston Lake Park, you feel me? Houston Lake Park. But my grandparents, you know, my grandma lives in uh, uh, the Marley. It's right next to the Westwoods and shit off of Alameda and, you know what I mean, and Feds and shit. But I, I, mean, I grew okay, up Alameda on Florida. Florida. I grew up on both sides of Feds in between Florida and Alameda. I've been all through that. I've been on both sides of Feds. So you're up, you're up at the top. With, yeah. My uncle lives over there on Knox and Alameda. Knox and Alameda, that's some oh, yeah. that's some straight west side shit. There's a lot of bloods over there, you yeah. feel me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, man, so a lot of people don't know that, that, you know, in Denver, they really be banging out there. And, like, I, I, I've lost oh, a few homies out there. So I've heard the story, some crazy oh, shit. Man. But, like, yeah, man. I just lost a homie explain the territories out there. Like, Rest in peace, my homie Dylan Adams, you feel me? But, Dylan Adams. Oh, you know some gang shit? Yeah. I think so, bro. bro. Bro grew up in school like that, you know what yeah. I mean? And bro was from Aurora. Okay. And you know how Aurora gets down and shit. There's they be a lot of in Aurora, yeah, yeah. Like Park Hill, Montbello and shit, man. They be yeah. wildin', bro. You know what I mean? I already mean? know that, yeah. But, but like, a fool that never been to Denver would just think it's a cow town. Like, oh, well, they don't know. They don't know. They don't, I mean, we know because we fuck with the streets, you yeah. know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm already know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, like, you know. But, yeah. It, it explain the territories, man, because I know that there's some kind of territory. Because, like, we used to have OGs from both sides. And when we would do a show, they would pretty much both come and make sure everything stayed, yeah, stayed legit. Stayed you know what I mean? So I don't really know too much about the street shit, but there's yeah. a lot of little hoods and shit. A lot of hoods. It's like a lot, a lot of bloods be beefing with bloods. You know what I mean? Just cribs be beefing with just Fools just be on the hate and shit, too. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's hard to blow up in Denver because of the hatred. There's a lot of shootings you know out mean? there at the clubs yeah, and shit like man. that. Yeah. But I feel like the more love you have, the more love everyone around you is going to have. You know what I mean? Right. So you got to be on that. You got to show people love. You know what I mean? You got to be an ear to listen to overall, what everyone got to say. Overall, Denver's been dope to me because every time I take my partners to Denver, yeah. anywhere we go, they're giving us weed. Oh, you from out of town? Uh -huh. Here, check that. Hey, smoke that on, but they're giving us. I mean, right. look, I got a poster up there. I brought little. Yeah, I brought a that fire man. Hey, yeah, I brought bro. little Kiki for the first like, time. You, Oh, so Denver, you see the poster yeah. up there? Oh, that's at the Roxy. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. How, how does you know just by looking at the poster? You already knew. I already know, bro. Damn. The Roxy, bro. The Roxy. Crazy. The Roxy is the spot, bro. You yep. feel me? But nah, bro, I grew up in Denver my whole life. I know how Denver fools are, man. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's a lot of love. Don't get me wrong. A lot of fools fuck with each other. And you'll meet a lot of friends through some weed, bro. Yeah. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. hey, hey, yeah, get yeah, this yeah. shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know yeah. how many fools I chilled with and smoked yeah, a yeah. session with without even know him? You know what I mean? Right. Like, I could go walk downtown and everyone would be like, hey, what's up, bro? Hey, yeah. you, you smoke yeah. weed, hit this, bro. You know yeah. what I mean? That's why everyone I like is man. cool. It's laid back and cool overall. It's pretty cool. Yeah, overall, it's cool, man. I was going to ask you, what does your dad think about this? But, like, explain, okay, now, who is your dad? I know you said you're the youngest son. Shit, man. I don't really talk about this shit too much because no one yeah. really believes me back in my hometown. Right, right. But my pops is SPM, man. I saw part Mexican. I love his car, you feel me? And I'm the youngest son. I'm the, the black sheep that no one really knows about, you know what I mean? Because right. I, don't, I don't live in Houston. I live in Denver. Mind you, bro, I'm, right. I'm states away, you know what I mean? I'm not really tied into... You know what so, I mean? So, I don't really so explain know for, for the viewers, like, like, how did that happen about with your moms or how how, how did it all? Because you're, yeah, how old are you right now? Story. How old are you right now? I'm 22. 22, okay. You know, I was born in May 2002, you know what I mean? Right. I believe that's around the same time that my dad got his sentence, you feel me? Mm -hmm. So I ain't never seen my dad a day in my life, bro. No. Mind you, you know? So um, when I was in first grade, that's like, what, five, six years old? My mom sat me down and was like, here, write these letters. But she she knows I'm not gonna write letters and stuff, you know right. that ain't me. So right. she's like, it's for school. I love school, bro. I love learning. I love expanding my mind. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, oh, it's for school. Let me write this fucking letter, you know. Mm -hmm. So I was writing letters to my pen pal. She's like, it's for your school pen pal, you know what right, I mean. Right. And so as the years went on, she would reveal little little by little who this pen pal was. Mm -hmm. And I'm sitting here thinking like, it's a female. Oh, oh this yeah. female got so much in common with me. I like pizza. His favorite food was pizza, but I didn't know who it was, bro. Then when one day my mom is like, "Oh, your pen pal is in jail and shit," mm. I'm like, "Whoa, what, what did my pen pal do to be in jail?" Then, "Oh, uh, your pen pal is a guy." Oh, my pen pal is a guy. Right. You know what I mean? Oh, these are pictures of of your pen pal. Right. So I'm looking at these pictures like, "Damn, I don't even, you know, I'm like who is this dude I've been how talking old were to you during that time?" During that, I don't know how old I was exactly when I seen the first picture of my dad, but I didn't know it was my dad at the time. And then I was in fourth grade, so that's like eight or nine years old. My mom was like, your pen pal is your dad. Or I might have been in third grade, or I was either seven to nine, you know what I mean? And she told me who my dad was. And man, to me, I just felt like my whole life was like, because I'm sitting here thinking like my stepdad was my, my real pops and shit, you know what I mean? Because like, mind you, bro, my, yeah, he treated me like I'm his. Like, he introduced me to everyone like, hey, this is my son. Brought him around his family, his mom, this is my son. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I'm sitting here like, this is my fucking dad, man. Right. This is my dad. I, right. I have a good, genuine relationship with this guy. Right, right. But I know he wasn't there the first two years of my life. I'm thinking, oh, maybe he was locked up the first two years. But he was, I was two when he started coming around. Mm -hmm. And so at first, I, I was trying to get to know this dude. As the years went on, he showed me mad love. Mm -hmm. Bought me school clothes to carry me, put food on my plate and shit. He was a hustler, bro. And I fuck with bro, cause he showed me everything I know. You know what I mean? Mm. So I'm sitting here thinking like, this fool's my dad. And then here's my mom like, nah, your your dad is this fool. So does yeah. he have kids too? Your my mom and my stepdad have one kid, and that's my little brother. Right. But my stepdad has another another kid, and that's my stepbrother right and stuff. On. And I have right. a good relationship with my stepbrother too, right, you know, right. cause I'm always around him and shit. So 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 did they know, or they they had to find out later on too? Who's they? My, like, like your dad, the one that you called dad, and, and your brother and stuff. Oh, no, nah, he knew off the rip. We would, we, we would go to, like, um, Angelo CDs, bro. Yeah. And we would go to the CD stores all the time and shit. Mm -hmm. And my step pops would be like, look, that's his dad and shit. And I'm like, what is bro talking about? That yeah. Is. And they would leave this section, and I would go peep that section, and I'd be like, who the fuck is SPM? Like, I, mean, I don't know. I never no, heard shit. not one song from this fool. My mom would never play my dad yeah. around me, bro. She wouldn't want me to see. My mom oh, thought shit. she could keep that secret from me as long as she she possibly can. So, so how, how long did she keep it again? Till I was about nine. She told me when I was nine. nine. Okay. But she told me, your pen pal is your dad. And then I'm like, oh, shit, that's fucked up. And then she's like, your dad is also a famous rapper. So now I'm like, what? I'm taking all this shit in. Like, what the, yeah. what the It's just, I'm not wrapping my little nine-year-old brain around that no, shit. No. And then I come to my homies like, hey, you know SPM? They're like, that's that f Man, you never heard of SPM? This, nah, put me on. But then fools, <laughs> man, you know what I mean? I was trying to put me on. Yeah, like, put me you on. The first, song? the first song, bro. So my stepdad's cousin, right? My homie Chops and shit, man. Uh, Cause I, I love my stepdad's family, man. I'm tied in, you know. Right. So Chops left his MP3 player at the fucking crib, right? Yeah. And just out of curiosity, I think my mom just picked that up and started listening to the music that was on there. No. And she found my dad. 
So I was probably like in fifth grade, maybe fourth grade. Man, I want to say fifth grade, but that's what ten around yeah. ten. It was field day, bro, for school. And I'm trying to get in my mood, like I'm finna do good on field day. I'm finna win all the little awards and shit. You know what I mean? So my mom was trying to get me into my 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 rhythm, my groove and shit. So mm-hmm. she's like, "You want to listen to your dad?" And I'm like, "What you mean? Like I'm gonna listen to my dad for the first time?" Cause mm-hmm. I ne- I didn't know his rapper name. I wasn't too curious. Right, you know? right. So my mom played. I want to say it was real gangster. Okay. Yeah, it was real gangster. She no no mm-hmm. why. But all she knows is that her youngest son is a real gangster. Now, and I'm listening to these lyrics, and I'm the youngest son out of my pops. Mm. So I'm like, oh shit, is he talking about me or is he talking about his? I was mm. just so confused, bro. I was just trying to. Did it make you want to go do bad shit? No, be real gangster? Bro. Or is it just like. Nah, but I'm growing good. up, I would always like write letters to my pops and shit, mm. and I would tell him the truth. Like, man, you know, I'm hanging out with my friends, and my pops always told me, like, one, one thing's for sure, he always said, pick the right crowd, man. Mm. Make sure you have good friends and you have a good circle around you because mm. he was just telling me how influential friends could be. Mm. And if you're around the wrong crowd, you're going to do bad shit, man. Exactly. And exactly. me, I don't know why, but I would just gravitate to these to these fools that were just fucked up in the head. Yeah, you know yeah, what I mean? yeah. And that would teach me fucked up shit too. And then I'm there doing the same stupid mm. shit, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. But it's like, I know better. Everyone wants, everyone around mm. me, loves me and wants me to do better i just couldn't you know what i mean i i, I would i was i would i wouldn't say a fuck up but i wasn't making the right move. Right. you know what i mean i'm a young right, right. Man, you know what i mean well they say sure. like you're the average of the five closest friends you have yeah exactly you know exactly yeah you hang around so the five yeah. people you hang around with the most that's those are the most influential people that's how you're most alike is the five right. people you spend right. your most time with you know what i mean yeah yeah that's facts i feel you on that one yeah, so I heard this song, bro, and I was just like, man, like, is this fool big? Like, how big is this fool? How many people know him? Like, right. you know what I mean? And then once I heard that song, I shit you not, everywhere I'd go, I'd hear that fool. Yeah, and it's I was everywhere more I remember. Like, yeah, <laughs> but I wasn't, I wasn't looking for it. I didn't, right, you know? right. But once I hear it and I'm looking for it, I'm it's like, there everywhere. <laughs> like, bro, there was times where I would wake up in the morning, my window's open, fool just beating that shit, bro, yeah. playing wiggy, wiggy, wiggy and yeah. shit. Who was you like, listening man. to as a rap? Was you listening to other artists? At the, do you remember who else? Oh, my whole life, bro. I love music. My 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 nana, my mom. They would always play music in front of me. I always be jamming and shit. You know, I like everyone, bro. I like New York shit. I like Texas shit. I like Cali shit. I like in Colorado, bro. It's super diverse. It's, it's, yeah, yeah, it's, it's diverse, in the Midwest, yeah. bro. So we get a lot of influence from. You know what I mean? Everywhere, bro. Right. From do you Cali, remember who Texas. you were jamming at that time when you first heard him? Your da- man, everything. everything. Everything, man. I was listening well, yeah, I mean, to oldies. Bro. I was listening to. Right. Let's talk about the Denver playlist, bro. Yeah, yeah, What's Denver, up, what? bro? I got a, I got a called... wide palette, man. No, no, I like, okay, I look, like look. a lot of shit. So, so man. me and him right. talk about the Denver playlist on the radio, because every time we go out there on the radio, like it'd be still some. Do you know the Denver playlist? Nah, I'm not too familiar. Well, man. I don't know, man. What you mean the Denver playlist? Like on the radio? Every radio time I go it's back, it's just a different, it's a different place. It's a different place. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, music's different. It's more like on K K S one oh seven five. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna hear like T Pain. Oh, I'm gonna hear that yeah, uh for sure. Nelly. You know, Nelly well, or some, you know, you know, that's it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're gonna hear like some Akon still, some you know. Akon. Yeah. Some uh, fucking uh, some classics, you know what yeah, I mean? Some classics, classics yeah. yeah. Play everything, you know what I'm saying? Everything, bro. So I grew up listening to everything. So a little bit of everything gets played yeah, out there, bro. and fucking, bro, they still be jamming them country boys. Yeah. With them big fat wheels. Yeah. Like, yeah. They be over there playing that like it was just yeah. yesterday, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, for real, yeah, bro. Yeah. Hey. And I like oldies more than I like the new shit, bro. Yeah. Just because I, I, that's all I grew up around was the oldies and shit, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah, I like I like old Houston shit. I like Lil Kiki and Southside, yeah. Southside and shit like that, bro. I fuck with Houston a lot. Like What's your the favorite? Music scene and shit. Well, I know a lot of people don't listen to radio no more, but as far as uh, Denver, what radio station do you listen to? If you listen to the radio station, um, I don't really listen to the radio station too much, but I listen to um, 
See, there's Let me see if you're going to say it. Let me see. There's 1075. There's like that new one. The that's flow the one you or something. Yeah, I listen to the old shit in there. Or the flow or something. The flow. Or, yeah, there you go. Or uh, Simon's Carter has so, one. That, that's yeah, the homie. You know, you know that's the homie, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I know I know a little that's bit about Simon's Carter. Yeah, they, they already told you? They told you about him? I tried reaching out to bro, but bro's just too big, bro. Ain't well, well, maybe he don't know. Mm-hmm. He yeah, but he about uh, to know after this this right here. Yeah, and nah, for sure, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, uh, yeah nah, man, like swimwear. I I know a lot of his homies too, and they know my stepdad, and you know what I mean. So, so in Denver, bro, everyone knows everyone. Yeah. And if you don't know that person, all oh, your homie knows about that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's very like close knitted, you know. Like rumors go around quick like that, bro, because everybody. It's about to go off this video right now. They about to see it yeah, out there. Yeah, you gonna see, so man. When you found out your pops <laughs> trapping, you told him about it. Who? When your you pops. Wrote, when you wrote your dad, like, hey, I didn't know you was you rapping. So, now. I don't know, man. You know, I don't really remember too, too much. I, I didn't really ask too many questions. But it made you want to rap, or you was already rapping? Oh, bro, I wanted to be a rapper before I knew who my dad was, my real dad was. And my stepdad always pushed me towards making music. He was always like, hey, I want to buy you a mic. I want you to start making music. Like, they always influenced me. They, want, they knew I was just destined for music, man. What was like, your first song you did? Shit, first song I did? Yeah. Just fucking around, you know what I'm saying? Just fucking around? I was probably like in third grade. But I used to rap battle fools all the time in school and shit. I love rap battling fools, man. Mm. Like, you know what I mean? Instead of recess, I'm not hooping up. I'm rap battling, you know what Mm. I mean? I'm like, Foos couldn't step to me, man. In elementary, middle school, Foos would try, but they just couldn't get with me. And that's how I know I'm like, man, I'm really gifted for this music stuff. Look, man, I'm going to tell you right now. So, you know, me, I got a long history in the rap game, right? So I bring people on the road, me, all these artists. And uh, out of nowhere, actually, Denver, we went to Denver and Aurora. I had Papa Smurf with me. And uh, them Foos start rapping right there in the motherfucking parking lot. But they always, like, when somebody was put to the test... They they'd have some for the crowd. You yeah. got some for the crowd right now? No beat, like some bars you can spit. Are you ready for that? You see, man. Yeah, I'm gonna have to be ready. Give them, give them, give them, give them a couple bars real quick so they can know what it bars, is. Man. On the spot. That's like on wow. The, on the spot. Out of nowhere, you know what I mean? Do you have a song like you remember, like a battle? Or just rap or just anything that you would give a you know somebody that you want to become a fan or of you, you and your music, more, you or you mean? just or you write more. Man, uh, my brother Malachi, the one that you, you met, he uh, he went to Denver last weekend. Yeah. And uh, I was just messing around. We were playing beats and shit. Now, and I just started freestyling. Mm. And he's like, fool, you don't fucking fall off. Like, you could freestyle for an hour, 30 minutes, and you yeah. don't fall off. And he even told my dad, like, hey, this fool could fucking freestyle. But it's like when I'm not even trying to do it. Right, right. right. You know what I mean? But if I'm like... Is there any way like, we, we could play a beat, like, like where it doesn't... Interrupt what we got going? Mm. Or nah? Pull up a cell phone, fuck it. What do you think? Cold, got it feeling like December. I'm obsessed with questions, thinking I'm a gang member. Shit, I'm a real thug and you're a pretender. I can't fuck with no dusty hoes. That's a no no, yo bitch in my phone, nigga. That's a low boat. I be paid down, I'm finna mix it with the polo. The money come back, my nigga. It's like a yo yo. You feeling G off with Tito's? I'm really next up. Shit, even he knows I catch more plays than fucking Shadow Josinko. Yo bitch, love me, cause you a motherfucker. Hey, bitch. I just pull to the scene, ayy, my click looking mean, ayy, I got cup in my room, man, lean on my cup, man, I stay fucking up, but these niggas know what's up, ayy, to my get on from the beat, I eat it up, no cap, fuck with us, nigga, it's a rap, and I don't like hoes, cause I don't get attached like a strap, bitches wanna fucking chase me, I don't give a fuck like my fucking next thing, got a big ass, nice ass, diamond fucking ring, rapping on the mic, but I don't fucking sing, hey, when I'm calling, just don't bling, hey, we gon' fucking pull up with this thing, hey, smoking on a little fucking stinger, hey, bitch wanna put my fucking ring up on my phone's fucking dead, shut up, give me head, every time I'm in the fucking crib, I'm loading lead, like what, hey, and I stay getting bread, I can't fuck with these cops, cause these cops be some feds, hey, hey, not for my these fucking jazz, I don't give a fuck, nigga, still fuck the feds, cruising down on 38th and my 
fucking feds. I don't give a fuck like my role is president. Ay, nigga, ain't no resident. I'm trying to chill in that fucking presidential. Nigga, I just screwed up in that rental. Ay, I'm not playing like a stencil. Lay him, lay him down, nigga. I don't play around. Don't even make a sound. I can't fuck with these clowns. I got so much shit, I'm gonna fuck around and drown. Smoking on this nice fucking pound. Hey, nigga, I can't motherfucking slip. You got 23, that bitch stay on my hip with a 15 round clip. I got so much damn drip. Hey, that's really fucking it. Let me sip on my tea, bitch. Let me get drunk. I don't give a fuck, man. I smoke the skunk. Pop your damn fucking trunk. That's that 215. It go motherfucking bump in it bump. Nigga, like that motherfucking bass. I got that Glock nigga in that might up your face in the stage. On some real yeah, shit, I'm getting on some warmed real up, man. Shit, though, you getting warmed up. Yeah, that ain't but shit, But y'all better man. hit that man for them features, man. man. Cause they, cause they fucking ready to go. I can do this I'm all gonna... night, bro. But every beat, I just get better and better and better. Fool, I'm yeah, just sharper than you, man. You, you, you rolled the beat. Some yeah. Beat, you the beat, nah. You fucking did that shit. All right. So I mean, what, what are you, what are your plans, your goals? What yeah. are you gonna do now? What do you got? What you got? Dreams? Like man, that? now that I'm tied in with the right motherfucking people, we gonna lock in and do the right yeah. fucking things, man. I'm gonna make my motherfucking music Camera and shit. Back on, Cosmo. I'm in the spot where I could, and you know what I mean? Yeah. Fuck the critique, and I'm gonna write my own shit, man. I'm gonna do my own shit, and I'm gonna. I really want my own label, man. Yeah. And I really want to pop off in Denver, and I really want to put Fuzz on. Denver because. needs it, bro. You, yeah, I, I see it, you though. You 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 got you got that move though. You doing nah, that shit? I mean. Shout out to Mile High Minute. There's yeah. there's podcasts and people trying to put Denver on the map. Yeah. But it's just, man, Denver needs something a little... Different. Need a leader. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, but you got to pop out. Everybody got to come out. Everybody got to come out. Facts. Yeah. Everyone needs to come together and really pop out. And what does that one do? Denver. Trev Rich. Trev Rich got one. Trev he got that. He's doing one. Uh, you know, he, there's he, a lot he like, of good foods, man. Like, like who? Go ahead and give us some names. Man, there's a lot of good foods, man. Yeah. But I don't want foods to like. You got social you know media to twist it, right? Okay. You have like what? Do you, you got Instagram and all that? Are yeah, you, are for you sure. Up to just, you ready to go? You yeah, know I'm ready saying? to go, man. But I'm just sitting on so much music that I haven't released nothing. No. Probably sitting on like a hundred songs and shit. I just need the right ear to be like, yo, there you go. drop this. Put shit. the plan and you shit behind it. Yeah. Plan. I just need some food that What's would just. Instagram and Facebook. So give them the RBI. Under, it's um, so I don't even know my phone's dead and shit. It's um, RBI Young Dom underscore three hundred three. RBR. RBI Young Dom. Yeah. RBI That's Young like, Dom. RBI stands for rare breeded individuals. Okay. So I'm just you know what I mean it's some shit my homie rest in peace RBI Luis you feel me he really came up with that shit man. Okay. And uh you know what I mean he's in the dirt right now but hey huh. rest in peace Luis I'm gonna keep it going rest for Luis. There you, you go. There you go. Hey, right, well, man, from what I heard today, man, you got the torch on that shit, boy. You finna light the street, bro. Ain't shit, man. But I know, I'm but you finna light it up. Yeah, tell finna, them, bro. Man, just, it we, might not be shit hey, to hey, you, but, but, but you might believe in me, like you might, you might pass yeah, up man. some motherfuckers real quick. It's always opportunity, man. You know, it's always I mean, opportunity. God I just need the right people telling me that That's shit, man. Cause ain't nobody really be like, yeah. hey, you gotta push that shit. No one. No matter what nobody say. Don't let nobody sleep on you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I feel that shit. Well, if they slept on you this far, you already know what it is. But at the end of the day, after this video. Man, y'all better yeah, tap in. This boy about the rock. You got to manifest your hit yeah. that you want. Yeah. Like, I man, I was just fucking around, man. Shit. I wasn't even. It was like, good, though, yeah. bro. You're yeah, on the spot. All the good shit is fucking around is when the best shit comes out. Yeah. And you're just fucking around. When you try too hard, then, you know, okay. Then it's just, that. you're trying too hard. It yeah. got to come out naturally, yeah. and you got to come out real. You know what I mean? Yeah. And no, it was good. I felt it. I fucked with it. It was different. I like the fact that you rolled the beat. You fucking, you went in and you weren't scared to fucking do it. Some people come up here, and I'll be like, I'll tell them that story. And I said, hey, you got to be that hungry, even though, you know, your pops is who he is. You feel what yeah. I'm saying? But if you still show that hunger and you kill that shit like that and, and you got something for him, that there's not, oh, man, not right now. Man, I don't know. Rashid, have you ever seen Rashid do any freestyles yet? Nah. Oh, Ra oh, Rashid will no go in the flea market or in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. It might be quiet. Rashid that's will fucking start rapping and everybody come out of everybody nowhere. Out. Yeah, that's oh. how I am in Denver, bro. Like, everyone that knows me, they be like, this fool can fucking rap. But go. me, I'm just like, man, that ain't nothing. 
Well, if I sit down and I really make a beat, man, mm -hmm. I mean, not a beat, but like if I, man, I can make a hit, man. Right. Yeah. And I'm sitting on so much music that is just so, like, I'm that. fucking up, man. I'm there like, I go. He got, he got shit, the beats man. too, so you know. You know, y'all watching, he got, man. see that, that, that's two things, man. He got the beats. I mean. He come rap on, you know, feature on your shit. You heard it here first, you know what I mean? Oh, it reminds me, man, you got to get your paperwork start straight from the beginning. Yeah. Like your yeah, publishing, facts. your register, of all your yeah. stuff, uh, your ASCAP yep. or BMI. ASCAP, BMI, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you're I legit. Mean, yeah, if you want you know your own I mean? label. Copywriting you know, shit, everything straight. If you want your own straight. company, go mm -hmm. stay to Colorado and pay for your company. Yeah, facts. You know facts. what I'm saying? It don't cost but $50 to get your own company in Colorado. Mm -hmm. You know yep. what I'm saying? And then from yeah, that, man. you go to the IRS, and they'll give you a free uh, tax identification number for free. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Take that to the bank. Boom, you're in business. You yeah. Like that. that See, I, I ain't never had no one spit that shit to I'm me. Just telling you, right? Yeah, that was but, it. Boom. Yeah, it's good to know this kind of stuff. You know, yeah, so yeah, you got to be around paperwork, people that'll teach you. Know what I'm yeah, you can paperwork got to be straight. You register, who's going to get mm -hmm. the check? You know what I'm saying? Nah, for sure. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, man. So, um, so you say you're, you're flying back out tomorrow? Gone. Oh man, eleven o'clock. I gotta be at the airport, man. I got work Gone. on Tuesday and shit. I already missed too much work. What do you what do you what do you do for a living right now? Uh, I work for the city and county of Denver and shit. I be uh, I'm a painter, bro. I paint all the rec centers in Denver and stuff. Okay. You know what I mean? So you know, I be painting. You gotta shit, work, man. man. But on the side, I do bathrooms and kitchens. Shout out my grandpa, man. He put me on since I was eleven. Like to build, working. like build them out. Yeah, build, you know, remodel bathrooms. There's money in that shit. Oh, I've been doing that since I, since I was eleven. I was I was still in high school working forty hours a week and still going to school and still making hell of bread, man. There's a lot of money in that. Now I respect my grandpa. He really taught me how to work with my hands, you know. I think though uh, the kitchens and bathrooms, those are like the most expensive jobs, really. For real. Like as far as flooring, tile, all that kind of stuff, you making it look badass. A, you can't get a brand new bathroom for less than five racks, man. Mm -hmm. Kitchen, eight, ten racks, man. Easy, yeah. you know what I mean. Yep. You've been paying cabinets. I mean, if you want some beautiful shit, like some designs and shit, yeah, now you really talking. Yeah, like 20000 you know 15, what I mean? 20, yeah. Yeah, facts. Hell yeah, It's man. just what the customer is trying to pay, and then... What do you think you're, you're okay, like, okay, like, because me, I have some stories, man, when I, because you work, you say you're your grandfather, your, your grandfather. Well, I work with one of my uncles. He was older than a motherfucker, but older he, than he, 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 he was a motherfucking master. Yeah. And he used to be in pain, and, you know, and then once I seen that, I was like, nah. and I can't do this all my life, because I'm going to be grandpa, fucked up like man. him. I'm gonna be fucked up when I get old. I thought bad knees, bad elbows, and shit. What is the worst project he put you through? Cause boy, we used to do football, football fields of flooring and man, shit. It Ooh. don't matter. Anything it just fucking sucks with him, man. He be ripping my ass. <laughs> man, I need this shit perfect. You retarded bitch. You did this. Oh, and I'm shit. like, <laughs> yeah, but nah. But it just pushes me to do better yeah. and stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah. So that fool's a, a tile master and shit, man. I done so much tile. We first started off as tile. Little by little, we started doing more and more, and then we started doing full bathrooms, full kitchens. He you owns know his own mean? company, right? Yeah. yeah. That's the shit. You, you know how you got to have a towel cutter? All right. I, seen, I cut seen a dude, I fucking seen a dude grab a regular circular saw and hit them corners, hit, hit the cuts. That's that fool, man. That's right. He's one of them. Grinder He's one of them. Yeah, yeah. Interesting, man. Some crazy ass fuck. cuts, man, just with the grinder. I'm like, man, you're a master, fool. Mm -hmm. And bro, bro, it's crazy, bro. Like, you ever seen like a wet a wet tile saw? Bro will take the cord off and fucking suck that straw in order to get that drip so it don't yeah. fucking like bro will just take the hose and uh, all that. He done did that. Yeah, he a dog, man. H have you ever worked a fucking all nighter like fucking just tired Not of all shit? nighter and shit? But I work fourteen hour days, twelve hour yeah. days. You know what I mean? Not fourteen hour days, but twelve hour days. Remember one time I did an all nighter, man. I was fucking zombied out by the morning, fucking. Yeah, man. Sometimes this fool will skip lunch man. and shit. He's like, "Fuck lunch! Like yeah. we gonna work, 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 yeah, work." You know what I mean? Check, man. Yeah, he ain't trying to come back tomorrow type of shit. You know what I mean? Top yeah. three yeah. restaurants in Denver or Aurora, Top wherever three, you want to say. Man, yeah. what you got? That is hard, bro. Top three. I'm a foodie, man. I know. That's good. Let's get it. Shit, man. Let's see what you got. Shit. Um. You ever say how to meet you? North Denver. Michi's. It sounds familiar, but I don't know. some Italian food, man. Uh -uh. They have really good salad, man. And they have good pizza. They have good pasta. Amici's some real good. But well, now we know you out there. When we come and we're going to come for... Actually, he's going next week. Okay, and uh, Thursday. We're going to lock in. Lord Loco lives out there, too, man. We're going to do so, a strong Loco's crib. Yeah. yeah hit me there up, go. man. There you go. go. Lab, man. That boy got the touchscreen, Raven mm. Studio, and all this. All weekend, man. My boy Loco. Mm -hmm. work on Loco. some music, man. Shout out Loco, man. Shout out Amy and shit. 
Yeah, man, that's what's up, man. It's good to see you, man. Uh, I had never heard about you. I heard about Malachi and, and, and you know, Los and JD and all of them. And, the and Carly. Shit, Shout out to all them. Yeah. But, yeah, so it's interesting to, that you ended up here today out of nowhere. Boom. Out of nowhere, like last minute. It was meant to be, dog. That's the universe, dog. Bro, we caught you coming out of the, uh, the okay, crib. You were about that. to leave. No. I'm walking out the crib, man. man. Just, we were okay. both walking out the 311. Shout out 311. I'm walking out the studio, 311, with Shadow and Mannix, our spot, man. And, no. and I walk out, and I seen Carly and uh, him and uh, Malachi. Malachi, man. Pulling. I'm like, what? I said, we're going to Mo's to do the podcast, man. Y'all just come through over there. Yeah. But I was like, I was just like, what's he doing here? What's what's going on, man? You know what yeah. I'm saying? I mean, I'm, I'm still like. Well, I didn't know who pulled up, but I seen the, you know, I don't want to say the color and all I'm that, but yeah. I'm still like, I'm glad to meet you, man, because, you know, Los is I mean, that's, like that's my cool, brother, man. That's cool, man. Right? I think it's interesting as fuck, man. And, you know, you got the flow. Family, it's man. great. And yeah, I was man, like, I'm this is going to lock in, man. That's good shit, right? That's good, man. Yeah, I'm cooking up, bro. I got to always be cooking up, man. I can't wait to hear some beats, man. Shit. I can't wait to hear yeah, some yeah. beats so I can just record some shit, man. Some good I'm shit. To record, okay. Man. I'm ready to step in the booth and lay a hot 16 down with some hooks and some just. Have you ever been anywhere else besides uh, here in uh, Colorado? What you mean? Like, have you ever traveled anywhere outside Colorado? of Colorado? Outside of Colorado? No. I've been he- to Houston twice. I've been to Florida once. I've been to Cali twice. Mm. I've been to Virginia once. Mm. So I've been around. I mean, like, you checked it out. You know what I mean? Uh, I drove to uh, Arizona, New Mexico, hey, I got a Utah, question for Las you. Vegas. No, so. If you was to do five city tour, what five? What five cities would you want to go rap in and do big show at? No. Shit, I, I'd get a lot of love in Houston, Denver for Sheezy, and uh, Las Vegas would be hard too. No. So maybe somewhere in uh, Aurora for show. I want to hit the Roxy, you feel me? Hit I want to hit the Okay, okay. you want to hit the Roxy, hit the, okay. The Fillmore, okay. Yeah. New you know Mexico. I mean? Aztec Theater. Fiddler's Green, fucking. New Mexico, you know. Arizona. Yeah, I want to go everywhere, bro. Yeah, I'm that's with what's it, up. Man. When you with the right guys, man, we going to definitely tap you yeah, in there. We got some man. shit lined up, man. Yeah. yeah, let's do it, man. We got Right now, we got 11 city tour but in I Texas. I ain't on no slacking shit, man. No. no, bro. I'm trying to, like, really. Look, right now, we got 11 city tour in Texas, all through Texas. I'm ready I'm talking about McAllen, man. San Antonio, Corpus Christi, yeah. uh, Dallas. We got fucking Houston. We got Austin. Sounds Fuck. like my kind of party, man. Uh, 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 Amarillo. Don't shit. Worry about one song at a time. Just do one at a time. Finish one song. Man, don't, I can don't, knock don't. one song I mean, at a time. I would say three. I would Every, say three. Yeah. So you can perform two or three. I, I, I'm gonna yeah. tell you how I am when I go to side three. So I go to side three in Denver. You feel me? If mm-hmm. if you know, you know. You feel side me? Side three is one of my favorite studios in Denver. Yeah. Me too. So bro. Like top notch. Top yeah. notch. Top of the, the line. Best equipment. Shout out to yeah. side three. You know what I'm saying? Man, the, the floor rotates around. 360, bro. Yeah. 360. And you got rooftop. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Back so here. he knows, man. Mm-hmm. Good, man. We know how to, a lot of the, yeah, the, the homies out there. I ain't even gotta say too much, bro. There's a lot of legends in Denver, bro. man. That a lot of people don't know of, man. But we, we fuck with a lot of them, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. I like to see how hungry you go. You're willing to be. Yeah, bro, I'm hungry. The game I'm is right starving. there for you to eat yeah. it up. You know what I'm it saying? Is. It's I really know great. it is, bro. And, and I'm so sad that no one fucking is hungry as me out of out of all my siblings, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Like yeah. I, I'm hungry. He's ready to go. Like, I'm, That's I'm a good thing, though. That's a good go, thing, man. And I'm ready to risk everything and say, "Fuck it, bro. I'm just gonna work on my music, man." Who would you like to work with? What you mean, artist or anybody? You know what I'm saying? You, bro. You got it going that's, on. Okay. I appreciate on, uh, that. You, you know? feel me? Well, I need, that's a done deal. Like, I got text messages years ago trying to get a beat, man. But I'm ready right now. Oh, Back then, ready. I was maybe on some bullshit. You know what I mean? But now I'm ready to lock in, stay focused, and really come up off my music shit, man. Who would you want to do a, a, a track with? Like rapping or something? Shit, I want Big X on one. I want, you know what I mean? I want to... Uh, uh, Plug. Big X the plug, bro. I want to. Uh, you fucking with that Mexican OT? Okay. That's yeah, what yeah, I was about yeah, to say. Yeah. Sauce Walker. I want to do a song with everyone from every state, man. You know mm. what I mean? The New York foods. You feel me? I want to do some tapping with Florida. I want to tap in with Louisiana. There maybe get Boosie on a track. That's or, the way to do it. You feel me? There we go. Hit Cali and do some stuff in Cali. You know what I mean? Some maybe that's what the dope house you know needs I mean? too, man. They need your energy, man. man they need you to I'm fucking ready, jump out and, and, I, and fuck I bring it up. different energy, man. 
I'm ready, fool. Like yeah. I'm ready, man. Yeah. You heard it right here. I just He's need ready. to be around the right people to make that happen, man. You and I know. feel like I'm in the right spot. You ready, man. You and, I'm, right. and, and I'm kind of bummed out. My siblings ain't right here chilling with me. You know what I mean? They will be, though. Yeah. They will. It's no, okay. No, it's, but just, it's the right time for everything. Yeah, but. It's like right now. This I'm is still ready, here right here. Fool. I'm just this saying is. I'm hungry, and I'm ready to get this shit popping. It's good. I'm ready to get, and put Denver on the map, Houston on the map. You know that's, what I mean? That's, that's, uh, what, that, that's no what they need, records. bro. That, that's, that's you know what I mean? Right I'm there. really trying to put on for everyone, man. You know what I mean? Right. And I'm ready to bring the sauce, man. Feel me? Well, man, on that man. note, man, y'all know what it is. Let them know how to hit you up, man. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I don't even remember my Instagram too much, man. Okay, my okay. Is dead. Well, look, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get it from him. And I'm gonna post it in the video. Well, hit yeah. me up. You know what I'm saying? Nah, nah, nah. You, we you got have Fileto. me on Instagram and yeah. shit. Fileto too. Yeah. Hit me up for on my Instagram, on my. I don't Facebook, know where you, you at. Know know what I'm saying? saying, if you want to work with them, RBI Young Dom. Yeah, they gotta break that bread though. They gotta break that. Well, bread. Of course they gotta break they the gotta bread because shit ain't free. Man. I don't like them. Hey man, all this no extra shit, man. Nah, facts. You gotta do the business. Gotta do the business. Yeah, business first. You know, do the business. On me. But yeah, definitely. So give them your. All your ads here. Faletto De Nero, man, on, on the on the Facebook and the Instagram, Faletto De Nero. And you'll see me on there holding the MPC. You know what I'm saying? My drum machine. You know, let's link up and make the shit happen. Get at both of them for beats. They both got yeah. the beats. Or you know what I'm saying? The show. You hit any one of us. All up, kinds man. of shit. We got that Texas tour. You already know what it is. Rock the stage tour. Hitting pretty much every city in Texas. Then we're going to jump out to New Mexico, Colorado, and Arizona. Yeah. You already know what it is. Find me at the real Mo Hustle. That's M O Hustle on Instagram. On Facebook, Mo Hustle. M O Space Hustle. That's what it is. We out this joint.